Greetings, Earthman, Origami Living Soil. God is good every day, day in and day out. He proves himself worthy, and we can just see it through his creation, how he's just made an amazing ecosystem that can survive on its own. It really doesn't need our help. Um, but let's get to the point. Um, this is part two of brown rice. Um, I'm going to inoculate it for an IMO1, and then eventually I'm going to go to 2. I'm going to add some brown sugar, make it 2, and then um, and then I'm going to make a tea with it and make a 3. That's mixed with wheat bran, the IMO2 mixed with wheat bran is IMO3. But right now we're doing IMO1 with the brown rice, and uh, yeah, uh, this is my IMO chamber. This is basically... A collection of different soil samples from different places that I've been in the Adirondacks, down in West Virginia, um, in um, Vermont, uh, New Hampshire, Maine. Uh, I've been in different places. I did get some microbes and a little bit of here and there from different places and uh, different sources such as a forest or maybe... Um, compost pile. Um, I put some Alaskan hummus in there, earthworm castings, and uh, just a lot of rich sources of bacteria and fungi. And then I sprinkled on top um, my uh, Grovana. And that, that's the Kickstarter right there. And uh, so I want to try to get as many of these microbes as I can. As you can see, I have it's just a rich soil mix. I'm going to smell it. it. smells pretty good. It smells nice and earthy. And, uh, yeah, it's just uh, the best of the best that I found. And put it all in this box. And now what I'm going to do is put the rice in there. The brown rice. It's, uh, the rice is a little crunchy. Um, but it should work just fine. And um, so what I'm going to do is uh, cover it up. And I'm going to do another video on this. Uh, in about a week or so um, when the, you know, mycocillin is formed on the top and then I'm going to mix brown sugar in with it. So the secret, my do, whatever I do, not secret, but um, I collect a lot of rich sources of bacteria and put it all in one bin. Put the rice in there, let it do its thing, get all that bacteria that's in there and fungi and then... Uh, and then I make uh, IMO2 and then IMO3 and um, works out really good, I'll tell you. And um, so, yep, there's the IMO chamber. You can make your own. Just look into different sources. But uh, I would look into Grovana. Um, and there will be links on, uh, on you know some, my page here at uh, Facebook. I think there's a link. But um, just check it out, Grovana. And uh, if you like... You know these videos. Uh, you know, hit like if you're not a subscriber. Subscribe. I got a lot more uh, exper uh, different experiments and little tips for you that God reveals to me. So may God bless you and your day.